As far as our forecast uh, for today, I said this yesterday, mixed clouds, anything from partly cloudy to mostly cloudy skies. Not an extended cool down, but we will see a couple of shots of cooler air in the seven day forecast. And even though we do have a couple of chances of showers, we have a couple of cold fronts coming through, mainly dry weather over the next few days. Rainfall still down to our south. We're actually going to be watching this feature here, a cold front moving through the Great Lakes. Those showers, just like yesterday, having a hard time pushing their way northward, but this cold front will be moving in. Thinking later on tonight, after midnight, we will be talking about a shower or two, even here. A little shower trying to work its way toward Tioga County of Pennsylvania, but again, they're having a real hard time moving their way northward. Potter County uh, looks like uh, Lycoming County with a couple of showers. Future track does pick up on the clouds, but again, I think we see some sunshine. Partly to mostly cloudy skies. There's your forecast for this evening with that clear sky cloud mix. This is at five o'clock tomorrow morning. And again, we're going to mention a chance of a shower, but those don't move in until after midnight tonight. You get some showers for your Wednesday tonight. Anything from nothing to maybe a, t a trace of an inch of rainfall for tomorrow. I said maybe five hundredths, maybe two tenths of an inch. Chance of showers decreases through the afternoon. Then we still see some clouds Tuesday or Wednesday night into Thursday. However, with a return to sunshine for Thursday, after a cool day Wednesday, temperatures will rebound to near 72 degrees. I said highs near 70 degrees. You can see future track shows a lot of 60, 67 for Ithaca, 64 in Windsor, 66 in Oneonta, and in Bethel, 64 in Margaretville. If you have any evening plans, might need a sweatshirt, might need a light jacket. Temperatures in the 50s and 60s. I did say lows tonight around 52 degrees. This does Throw a couple of 40s in there like Great Bend, Afton, Oneonta, all at 49 degrees. 54 in Ithaca. We have 50 in Owego, 50 in Delhi, 53 in Roscoe, 54 in both Bethel and in Monticello. And we get the clouds, the showers. We have that cold front coming through. We are going to be cooler tomorrow. You can see Future Track does give us 50s and 60s. 61 for Owego, 60 in Afton, 63 in Hancock, 60 in Roxbury, 62 degrees in Bethel. Might have to bump those winds up a little bit. I said southeasterlies at 5 to 10 miles per hour, but you can see the leaves blowing around a little bit. Might have some higher gusts, but still 63 degrees. South-southeast wind at 9 miles per hour, not a bad day. Temperatures are in the 60s, mainly 60s, 65 in Owego. We have 63 in deposit, 64 in Monticello, 66 degrees in Margaretville. There it is. We get that sun cloud mix for today. Same thing for tonight. This does show Binghamton with the highest 66 degrees. There's those evening temperatures in the 50s and 60s, but overall, not a bad start to the month of October. Mixed clouds, 70 for a high southeast wind. Again, bump that up to around 5 to 10 miles per hour. Mostly cloudy skies. Those showers don't move in until after midnight tonight. Lows near 52 degrees with the south wind at 5 to 10 miles per hour. Chance of rainfall tonight, it's low, 20%. 40% chance of showers on Wednesday with a high of 64 degrees. There's that warmer weather on Thursday with part, or mostly sunny skies, a high of 72 degrees. Night showers Friday, early showers on Saturday. We go from 72 on Friday to 66 degrees on Saturday. Plenty of sunshine on Sunday with that high of 66 degrees. Another round of showers on Monday, highs near 60. That's a cool day in the seven-day forecast. Lows will be in the 40s and 50s.